Hello, I'm Tony Hale. Perhaps you've used EcoAtlas to explore the condition and extent of California's aquatic resources. Well, then you've likely already discovered its ability to track wetland restoration projects. Or maybe you've downloaded data that have been used in key management decisions. Well, have you checked out EcoAtlas lately? Over the past year, we've listened to you, our stakeholders, and we've responded by improving some of the features of EcoAtlas. Today, I would like to show you some of the enhancements we've made to the Landscape Profile Tool, a resource that lets you examine the landscape at multiple scales and aggregate data from various sources. Some of the latest advances in web mapping are now at your fingertips. When you open the Landscape Profile Tool, you have the opportunity to draw your own area of interest. Now, after first drawing your polygon, it remains editable, so you might fine-tune the boundaries in very intuitive ways. Drag the polygon's edges to edit the shape. You can still select your area by watershed, county, or hydrologic region, but this highly customized shape allows you to cast your net as broadly or as narrowly as you wish. You can then name your area of interest for future reference. Simply give your polygon a name. Download this polygon into your computer so that you can upload it later the next time you wish to generate a profile for the same area. The time you spent refining your polygon need not be duplicated again. In fact, you can now upload up to 20 separate KML files to the map. In this way, you can visualize multiple polygons within the same landscape context. Double-clicking in the Polygon of Interest generates the Landscape Profile Report. You will find some new and changed elements. We added square miles to all acre metrics. Section headings feature new explanatory text furnished by our team of scientists. Land cover classifications now only show land cover for developed areas and have been updated to use the most recent satellite data. With an awareness that human beings are living in and moving through the landscape, we now feature languages spoken within the context of the census data. We recognize that cultural awareness, along with scientific findings, must factor into resource management decisions. Eelgrass surveys reporting an important aquatic resource are now prominently featured along the coast from Humboldt Bay to San Diego Bay. The report provides summary coverage statistics showing change over time as well as information about new and ongoing eelgrass-related wetland projects. As before, you can generate a PDF version of the report to file away, associate with the key decision, or email to others. Thank you for joining me today on a review of the latest enhancements to the Landscape Profile Tool in EcoAtlas. We welcome your feedback on our progress and look forward to showing you some of the new features that are emerging just over the horizon.